What stands between digital currency and mass adoption? Some say there has yet to be a killer app invented, but if currency itself is not at least the first killer app, then probably nothing is. Perhaps the mystery between here and mass adoption can be dissected if we look closer at the user base of this $10 billion plus industry, which is primarily computer programmers, tech enthusiasts, and risk-loving day traders. And this is awesome, but chances are that your mother does not fall into one of those categories. Is it reasonable to pine for mass adoption for a product that your mother is not interested in? Well, lead developer of Dash, Evan Duffield, wondered that very thing when he sat down one day with his mother to use Dash with her, and one of the first things she remarked upon was how weird and uncomfortable she felt with alphanumeric addresses. Now this may sound strange to the cryptographer within you, but we would do well to realize that most people aren't interested in these sorts of things. And so what is to be done? Well, Duffield took his mother's input and has developed a forthcoming product called Dash Evolution, set to be released in late 2017. And it features benefits that especially a mother could love. Three in particular. One is the implementation of usernames in place of alphanumeric addresses. Usernames that can be used over and over again, say placed on business cards or on websites. And yet each new payment will land in a separate address, maintaining the user's privacy. Second is the availability of services that people are used to, such as password resets and easy accessibility of backup information. These services will be made available from a completely decentralized class of service providers who pull information from the Dash blockchain using the world's first decentralized API, or DAPI and the user information they pull will be stored in Dash's new storage mechanism on its blockchain entitled Dash Drive. And third, and perhaps most important when transacting with strangers online using magic internet money, is the ability to rate transactions and to seek mediation in the case of a dispute of a transaction. It sounds magic, it sounds fantastical, maybe even impossible, but you can check all of the documentation out for yourself if you like at dash.org slash evolution. Dash is heading in such a fantastic direction to offering digital cash to everyone and their mother, in fact, that this show, Dash Detailed, has been created for the sole purpose of tracking its progress and bringing that back to you. Dash Detailed will come to you with a new episode every Wednesday, which I am only too keen to get into your inbox, should you like. If so, send an email to amanda at dash.org with the word subscribe in the subject line. And I look forward to seeing you this Wednesday and all of the Wednesdays to follow. Have a nice day.